funeral supplies in short supply. Still not back to pre-pandemic numbers by any means. And that is where we begin at 6. Thanks for joining us. I'm Jolene Cheney. I'm Kevin Ogle. Short on supplies at a very emotional time for families. Funeral homes now wanting you to be prepared to make backup decisions on things like caskets. News 4's Ashley Moss joins us with details. Ashley. That's right. Funeral directors tell me there's a trickle down effect causing materials delays and it's prompting those hard conversations with families. It's just supply chain issues are, are getting to these casket manufacturers and uh, it's caused a great struggle for them. First the pandemic, now the supply chain, a one two punch for funeral homes. One that's leaving them searching for supplies, but also some grace. I was explaining to a gentleman, uh, the funeral is tomorrow, that the casket that he had wanted to have for his mother is not available. The issue, things like caskets, the granite used to make grave markers, even embalming fluid, all in short supply. It's still not back to pre-pandemic numbers by any means. Funeral homes now asking grieving families already dealing with a lot to have a plan B. We are asking them to make the multiple choices because we don't want to prolong this any longer than they have to. Jeremy Sparks with Dignity Memorial says they've even gone out of their way traveling to other cities to pick up caskets that are in short supply. And even if that means that we have to get into a vehicle and travel to Dallas or Kansas City or something you know beyond that to be able to accommodate a family's uh, wishes and desires, we're definitely going to do that. I guess just a matter of time. Uh, until, until hopefully this, the, the, the manufacturing process and the supply chain process returns to normal. And another thing to be concerned about tonight, funeral costs creeping up due to an increase in things like fuel prices, raw materials.